This is the fourth video in my do-it-yourself coffee can foundry furnace series. In this video, I'm going to uh, touch on the subject of uh, burners, specifically the use of uh, propane torches as an initial furnace burner to get you started. In a later video, I'm going to go into some detail about constructing a much higher powered air-assisted propane burner for this furnace. This would be constructed from standard plumbing pipe and standard brass plumbing fittings. I'm showing two uh, propane torches here. The one on the left is a trigger torch type. Uh, you press a button and it lights and uh, there's another button so that uh, it'll stay lit without you keeping your finger on the trigger. These are sold at uh, home improvement stores such as say Home Depot for uh, plumbers to solder copper pipe with. You may even already have uh, one of these and uh, it certainly delivers enough heat to melt the uh, crucible shown in between the two torches filled with aluminum. The torch on the right is simply another uh, variety of uh, propane torch. It'll work fine too and again would deliver enough heat to melt the crucible shown full of aluminum. Use of the torches for the burner is, of course, extremely simple. Just to light it, lock it on, and insert it into your burner tube. I'm going to free the camera and take a look in the top here at this point, now that the propane torch is running in the furnace. Well, let's put the lid on and let it heat up for a minute and then take another look inside. This has been running about two minutes now. I changed lids to one with a slightly larger hole so that the camera has a chance of uh, seeing inside without me having to remove the lid constantly. As you can see, it's getting quite hot in there, even though there's uh, no crucible inside. And this is just from uh, the propane torch shown. I'm just going to switch torches here to show that the other one works too. I've lit it. And it's also burning fine now inside the furnace body. Outside of the furnace doesn't get very warm for a long time. It will eventually, but even uh, the melting of brass in this one has not uh, burnt the paint off the coffee can. This is my self-made burner for this furnace. It's made from uh, plumbing parts such as uh, steel pipe and a few miscellaneous brass fittings as well as a uh, <coughs> burns uh, propane torch head. This one can run on propane or map gas cylinders. 
and it has this tube here which I connect up to uh, compressed air through a regulator so I can vary the airflow and this gives the furnace an air boost. Using this type of a burner, which is a lot more powerful than the uh, plumber's torches, allows copper and brass to be melted easily in this furnace. I'm going to do a separate video on the construction of this type of burner.